So how heavy do you have to lift as a beginner at home? So this is my little area where I have people test weights. And usually I'm recommending the kettlebell set because I can have a lot of versatility with the three weights in the kettlebell set. It's five, 10, and 15. Now, the other thing I have my patients always do is figure out what weight can you do for bicep curls. So when I do bicep curls, people are always like, oh, should I start here? This is like one, two, three. Probably not. It's probably more like eight, 10. So if you go to the store and they sell weights, you can try to do a set of bicep curls right then and there. You can also use resistance bands to do bicep curls. These are the resistance bands I, see, I use and you can put a handle on it. But the resistance bands and the kettlebell set are the cheapest options with the most versatility. You are going to need something to do with your arms and your legs. Now with the kettlebells, you can hold one bell at a time and do a bicep curl or you can hold two like the five and the ten if you need more resistance i also like the kettlebells so when you're doing like a mini squat or a deadlift it's very very easy both the resistance bands and the kettlebell are in my tiktok shop i also have a beginner weightlifting routine which when i say beginner it's super beginner like super duper i almost didn't even share it because it's so beginner and i thought oh my gosh what if somebody sees that and thinks like but guess what? That's the majority of people, real people like, how do we do this? What do we do? And I want you to feel comfortable doing a few things in your home. And this is a good place to start.